Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well. I'm gonna jump right into a read, see what everybody has going on. Woohoo, out there in the collective. Whoa. Spirit, what is it you would like the collective to know at this time? Here's some thank you. We've got the Hierophant and the Upright. Hmm. Challenge by the Lovers. Hmm. Subconscious. We've got the world, end of a cycle, in the recent past. We've got moving on to calmer waters, a relationship ending, leaving something behind, intention and expectation. Sneakiness, bullies in the near future. Something very swiftly, Eight of Wands. The lens is being looked through. The Eight of Swords. Somebody's feeling restricted. Wanting to break conflict quickly in the environment. Mm, got the devil in the upright. Hopes and fears. Got the high priestess here. Mystery. Mystery woman. Hmm. The outcome. Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. Jealousy, deceit, suspicion. page of cups somebody trying to manifest in a new love offer a new love opportunity because they're they yeah they're trying to trick something because they're in a hangman position they're trying to be tricky but the truth is going to be seen What do you want? Mm. I really treated myself nice today. I'm all kinds of relaxed. the higher vent here. Home. Ooh, the higher vent. <clears throat> Home and the snake. The higher vent. Um, Right, could be like God versus. <laughs> Are they gonna duke it out, man? 
What's going on? Are they gonna duke it out over these over these divine unions? And 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 the completion of this cycle? Wow! What the heck? Yes, lovers who've done things perfectly. <laughs> wow! Wasn't expecting that. Teacher. These lovers are um, teachers or perhaps somebody's challenged by the teacher. Somebody's challenged by a teacher. This is the completion of this cycle. Here and now. Moving on to calmer waters in the recent past. Moving away from the drama, a transition away from the drama. But somebody uh, wants to bring, well, somebody's here with drama and intending to bring more trickery and stuff. So somebody's present here. You're trying to get on down the road you're like, hey, man, I'm ready for a vacation. And they're like, no, you're not. We're going to fight some more. And you're like, oh. You're all, they want to bring conflict to this, to this wholesome person or these wholesome people. They want to, they just can't stop bringing drama to wholesome people. <laughs> I mean, really, they're just trying to walk away, man. And they're like chasing after him. Very quickly, we've got an Ace of Wands. Oh, somebody's being haunted. We got eight, Ace, I mean, an Eight of Wands. Eight of Wands, something, something very ha important is going to happen very quickly. The lens that's being looked through is an Eight of Swords, so there's a restriction. A restriction, a remembrance. Somebody important is going to try to re bind this um, person. There's a devil here mm, in the environment. Let's see how it goes. Interesting. Ooh. Ooh. Nitty gritty. Ooh, the nitty gritty. This devil um, wants to make a change because this witch is haunted. Wow, these things are just popping out. Holy moly. Oh, we got prophecy here. We got the high priestess, mystery, hidden wisdom, high morals. Out there, little buddy. Religion. A high priestess. Huh. There's a high priestess in the religion and a religious practice. Hmm. Hope and fear. This devil is trying to cause a change because this witch is being haunted. They are going to see a high priestess who is perhaps a re in the religious community or whatever. 
they're hoping that this secret wisdom that she holds will be able to what change the situation or maybe they think that she's doing it it looks to me like their hope is that they think that um that they'll be able to put it off on this this person who's being seen as important. We do have a queen of pentacles in the reverse, so there's fear, mistrust, somebody's being devious. They're not getting a message. They're not they're not being congratulated. They're not receiving hospitality. We've got vanity on the bottom of the deck. And it's time. It's prophecy for the conscientious people to come into leadership roles. For the conscientious people to come into leadership roles. And you know um, that the, the minds are... are seen by everyone right now like there's there's like the ancients right who have with the ancient wisdom and ways of doing things and there are the technological geeky um <laughs> i don't know man There's two distinctly different, um, it seems to be, you would think that it would be considered a life form, but techno technically I don't know that it could be labeled as such. Although it is advanced and very skilled and very wise, holds a lot of wisdom. I don't know, man. I don't. Oh, the Hierophant from the home front is here with the snake, finding him unworthy. Ooh. He's challenged because he was a teacher or something coming against these lovers. Or he taught people how to come against them. Out of ego. Out of pride. He made a war with love. This is the end. This is the world. So we got the completion here and now. Dishonesty. The snake is dishonest. Yep. Somebody wants to bring drama to you uh, moving away or to... So these lovers moving away. These love unions are reciprocal. Equal give and take. And yeah, somebody's wanting to bring drama to them, but they're making mistakes. They want to bring conflict, the five of swords, to this wholesome person. Mm, 
they're in regret over this wholesome person's soul contract. Hmm. A new soul contract. Equal give and take. Soon to be making a journey. And these ones are like, they're still, they're bringing conflict. They're like, they're, they're, they don't want to let you go. They don't want to stop. They're in regret. They're like, no, they're like, they're trying to force an ending before it even begins. Mm. Chaser. There could be somebody that thinks they're important who's going to be chasing. They're chasing after this person, after this woman. Could be air travel. They could be flying in to, um, to put this family line in a binding. They got to do it in person or whatever. They got to get it. They got to get some sort of a commitment. Yeah, they got to get some sort of a commitment so that they can bind this family line again. They need a soul tie, but there's already a soul contract. They need to come in in the in the 3D and and do some trickery, pretending that they are, you know. Just don't get too eager. You got the devil in the environment wanting to make a change because they're a witch or they ha their main witch is being haunted right now. Yeah. You're coming into a reunion and they feel unappreciated. They feel like you don't care. They're haunted and they need you to take it off of them. They need you to wear it. They need you to make a commitment, get a soul tie. They need you to be haunted. You need to pay their debt is what they're thinking. They feel as though you are inseparable and they're here bringing conflict. There's a high priestess here and, and the religion. And a religion. You're seen as irreplaceable. You're not overwhelmed. You're not overwhelmed. And it could be, I don't know, I mean, maybe they, yeah, they need you, they need you to be overwhelmed. They need to put this on you. They're going to be devious and um, come forward with deceit to create conflict, to put that on you. They're not giving the message or they're trying to block messages of congratulations or they're not being congratulated and they don't want to let anybody know that. There's an understanding there. This is um, objectivity. Everything's been looked at very closely, both sides of a situation. And there's going to be a big reveal or everything has been revealed. There's confusion here and they're unsatisfied with um, the destiny. They could be in their shadow side, alone, feeling like they sabotage themselves and their partners. And they feel guilty for daydreaming about being you, for trying to be you. It was an unexpected outcome and now they don't know what to do. 
they neglected um, to give you what you needed. They neglected you. And now there's a new chapter here. And somebody wants to hear your voice. And it's too late for anybody to do anything about it. Simply have too many differences in values. You know, some, some are about things, about money. And some are about re family and responsibilities, you know. And unfortunately, um, some people who are all about money decided that some people who were about family and responsibilities shouldn't have that, nor should they have any money. I don't know. I mean, I know that, you know, some of us didn't have any of that. So, What you got? Oh, so this snake. Could be a mature man. They're here. They're here. So there's Hierophant who is, you know, could be like. And then the, the, you know, the upper and then the snake is the lower or whatever. However you want to view the hierarchy thing, whatever. I don't even know how that goes because I don't know nothing about that. But they're here and they're discussing this marriage, right? The marriage of these lovers. The snake has been found unworthy by the Hierophant. The Hierophant says you're unworthy. You taught people to come against love out of ego. You taught people to hurt love. And it's, it's going to stop. It's over. They're challenged because they're being made to stop. They're being made to stop. This is the end. This is the completion of this cycle. And, and that's here and now. It's happening here and now. Okay, they've been found to be dishonest. Ooh. We got a courtship. They're no longer going to be able to work against this courtship. Moving on to calmer waters, to a reciprocal um, relationship, a union. Could be an official person. Somebody's making mistakes, bringing drama. Bringing drama. You're, you're, you're moving on to calmer waters. You're making a journey, right? And you got somebody making mistakes, trying to bring drama to you. They're in, they're bringing a five of swords to this wholesome person who's who's in a soul contract. They're very regretful. They're like, no, don't go nowhere. But you're like traveling. You're like moving on. You're this privileged lady. You're this gift, right? Or you have a gift, or you're receiving a gift. Again, we got journey. This important person or somebody's chasing you very quickly. They're doing air travel. They're not going to be able to affect the change. They don't want this change. They want to stop this change. They want to do a binding on this on this woman's uh, family line. And they want to do that through gaining a commitment um, through a soul tie. So they have to rush in really quickly. There's air travel here. It's an eight of wands. They need to manifest this very quickly. They're chasing this person. It's super important. That's the most important thing. 
right now is to put this person in a restriction. This privileged lady and her gift, this wholesome person. Right away, they need to get in here and rest restrict this person so that she doesn't come into this union. He needs to he needs to trick her, basically, into um, forfeiting her divine reunion. He's not going to be able to get the unexpected income, or he doesn't want this person to gain the unexpected income. It's the devil or the Diablo. They're trying to change. This witch is having um, hauntings going on. They feel unappreciated. Um, they're upset about this reunion that's happening. They're trying to... Yeah, they're, they feel very upset about that. About the great fortune. High Priestess, religion, you're irreplaceable, you're not overwhelmed. There's a community of false people here. So a High Priestess who is of this religion, it's, it's, a, it's a community of false people that find you irreplaceable. You're not being overwhelmed or you're not feeling overwhelmed at this time. So um, they're um, jealous of that and they're being deceitful. So they didn't get a message or they're hiding a message. They didn't get congratulated. They didn't get accepted. They're not, they're not being seen as having done a good job and there's understanding because both sides of this situation has been looked at closely. Yeah. This ma this mature woman who see this mature man is the snake, right? And he's got his mature woman here. And this mature woman is um jealous as all get up of this main female, this privileged lady who has a gift. Message there is in reverse, but here we've got message in the upright. So it doesn't really look like um the fact that they're trying to, or maybe they didn't get a message. Maybe this mature woman didn't get a message, but this main female did get a message. And she's very jealous about this because she wasn't congratulated for whatever it was she was doing. And both sides of this have been looked at very carefully. Everything has been seen. This Hierophant has looked at everything very carefully and understands both sides of the story. Yeah, this mature woman didn't get the message or the or the um, congratulations, but this main female did. There's expectation here, and we have reveal on the distant horizons, which has somebody in despair. They're in despair um, that these lovers are coming together, and that could be the big reveal. Like maybe on the distant horizons, like in the near future. Very quickly, something is going to be um, announced. Hierophant's putting a stop to this. <clears throat> this mature man has been found unworthy. He's a snake. And he's, he's, he, he, his ability to mess around with these marriages that are um, going to be going home or whatever um, is being put to a stop. 
<clears throat> and again, he's being challenged by a coffin in the challenge position. And his ego, he can't he can't move against these lovers anymore. The marriages anymore. His rituals aren't working anymore. This is the completion of a cycle here and now. They're no longer able to work against this courtship. They have been found dishonest. Yeah, they've been found dishonest, but there will be um, ooh, desire and value here. So this courtship is, there's desire. It's, it's a high honor, a high value courtship. Um, it's, it's seen as cream of the crop, best of the best. Like, ooh, I'm going to wax it every week. I'm going to polish it up. I'm going to give it all my love. These ones who are dishonest, they're a little they're a little worried because they're facing confinement. And they're gonna have to live and learn. It was all a dream. We've got conflict. This is the conclusion, right? So you're moving on, um, going to peaceful, calmer waters, becoming an official person, or perhaps it's an official person that is moving you forward, or perhaps you're coming into a union of reciprocity with an official person, or this could be some sort of a partnership, a business partnership or whatever. Uh, I don't think so because it's got the lovers here, right? So anyway, there's conflict because um, this is the conclusion. This is the end. You've uh, received a gain here. But they're still bringing uh, drama toward you, right? They are, But they're making mistakes. They're making mistakes because they're afraid. They, they can't stop themselves. They can't help themselves. They're in a five of swords and they're offloading it. They're like, Ooh. they're like, get back here, come here. And you're like, no, I got my own thing going on here. And they're in major regret about that. Oh, they might be trying to hide evidence. They're trying to hide evidence. Uh, might be a little late for that. So somebody sees this is very important. They're chasing you or this person here, this privileged lady. They aren't able to affect a change. Or they don't want this to change. But it's changing. Oh. Sweet dreams. They can't change. They can't change your sweet dreams. Your lazy days your lazy days, your sweet dreams. So somebody, it could just very well be, you know what this could very well be? 
is that whoever this is, it's been conflict and drama and all that. It could very well be that they cursed themselves. They, re they restricted their own darn selves and cursed themselves. They didn't get the income. They didn't get the income. And now they're going through withdrawals because you know why? Because this, uh, there it is. The reason why is because this um, person here has a new soul tie, a new commitment. <laughs> they curse themselves. They're going through withdrawals. This devil, and he wants to make a change, or there has been a change. The witch is now being haunted. They're feeling very unappreciated because this reunion's coming together and it's got a great fortune and they're and they've got haunting. And they're like, but I worked really hard. Why didn't I get a reward? And it's like, but you did get a reward. The reward that you worked for. They fell into their trap. They created for themselves. Or that they created. They created this trap and they fell into it. And there is a reunion here, the, a great fortune, a, a reunion, a beautiful family, a caring family, reciprocal relationship. Yeah, this, this um, devil witch is, is feeling really bad about this change. They're not liking it one bit. You, you love yourself. You love yourself. You know, and it's so weird, you know, in life, they can take from you everything. Everything. They can make you become your own worst enemy. You will be so good at punishing yourself. Maybe you've already experienced this. But that is really good because, you know, while in that mode, in that dark phase, you learned exactly what it was like to wear the shoes of, you know, many positions within that field or that realm, right? And you chose that loving yourself, even when it was absent from everybody around you, maybe even from in your own side, maybe you just got so sick of it. And you said, you know what, I'm going to do something different. And you said, I'm going to love myself. Hey, devil, I'm going to go love myself. I'm going to go make my, I'm going to go make my light shine. I'm going to go get myself all shiny on the inside. I'm just going to go love myself. Yeah, they don't like that. They don't like that one bit. You know, somebody who loves themselves is irreplaceable. Somebody who doesn't get overwhelmed by, you know, minor or major things easily is irreplaceable they're really doing the work and shadow work is not fun man it'll leave you in a puddle of tears for hours even we've got um so now there's they're going to send it in this false high priestess and this false community religious community they want to compromise. They're going through withdrawals. They're furious because this family is coming together. This mature woman is jealous of this main female. She got a message and she didn't. The main female is being congratulated and the mature woman isn't. Both sides of the of this situation, both her side and the main female side, have been evaluated thoroughly. There is a complete understanding. And she's jealous because the main female got the message and she didn't get one. The message of congratulations. Job well done.
because her profession was to cause mental disturbances for people. And apparently this Hierophant doesn't feel that that's worthy of a reward of anything except a haunting. They fell into their own trap. That's what they worked to create and this is what they're getting in the environment. And they feel unappreciated. That's wild, man. They're furious. On overload. They're on overload about this eternal love. And they want to apologize. They're bound to their commitments. They could be feeling weak over the promotion of this gift. I guess it's good news and fate that um, this main female gets to go have a life of indulgence, spa days and stuff. <laughs> spa days. Uh, they thought they thought that pride would outdo um, merit, I guess. But you get the promise, and it's time. It's the scheduled time. You've reached your goal. And with that, I'll sign off, and I'll see you on the next one, everybody.